Hey guys, so um, this is going to be a video. This is video number two in the Getting Started Step-by-Step -step series. And this video is going to show you how to set up your website. Now you've already created your account, but until you set up this portion, um, your system will not be working for itself. So you have to make sure that um, there are some things that you need to do to make sure that your website is working properly once you've created it. So once you create it, you're automatically going to go into the members area, which um, looks like this. Uh, this is a little bit big. I want to just show it bigger so everybody can see what I'm talking about. But it will take you to your members area, and you'll see these these six things, six, seven things across the top. And the first thing that you're going to need to do in the next step of getting your website set up is to update your referral numbers. Um, so what to do, what you're going to do with updating your referral numbers is you're going to go over here to social and you're going to do update personal info. And this is where you would update any of the information that you have. Um, even if you're updating like a Google voice number, you might need to update your email address. This is the same place you're going to go. But right now we're going to talk about referral numbers. So it's very important that you update your referral numbers because if you do not update your referral numbers, your sponsor is going to get paid for your referrals and we don't want that happening so we have to make sure that the referral numbers are updated so in order to find your referral number that you put back in here you're going to sign into whatever zaz freebie site you are registered on um, there are six different sites um, you may have started with a larger site and also got um, a smaller site um, so if that's the case then you're going to log into each one of those accounts and you're going to get your referral number from Zaz Freebies, and then you're going to go back over and update it in your um, back office. So I'm going to sign into my Zaz 40, and this is how you get your referral numbers. You're going to log in, and then once you're logged in, you're going to um, you can either click here where it says your referral link for just this site. So it's just going to be the one for this is just my one for Zaz 40. My number is 10. Your numbers are going to be um, five digit numbers. And you will, or you can also go to profile and to this page and also get your referral numbers, where you can also get the email of the person that, that referred you to Zaz Freebies. Um, so once you have that number, you're going to come back over to the Making Easy Dollars Marketing System. You're going to erase whatever numbers are here because, again, like I said, these are the numbers of your agent, so you don't want their numbers being in here. So you would erase whatever is here. You would update it with whatever number you're given for your referral number. You will come down here and just save changes. So that's the portion of updating your referral numbers. The next thing that you need to do is you need to create your capture page or actually choose your capture page. So at this point, you're going to go to pages and capture pages. And I'm going to make this a little bit smaller. I was trying to hide some personal information there. I'm going to make this smaller. Um, so now you're on your capture pages. Now, if you are on the $40 site, you're going to go down here to categories. I'm going to move myself out of the way here so you can see what I'm talking about. If you're on the $40 site and that's the site that you're going to use as your um, primary site, you're going to click Zaz 40. If you're using Zaz 50 as your primary site, you're going to click on Zaz 50. If you're using 60 as your primary site, you're going to click on Zaz 60, so on and so forth. So I'm going to um, go to my Zaz 40 because that is the one that I promote the most. And you're going to see all of these different capture pages come up. Um, you're going to choose your capture page. So in order to do that, you're going to click where it says make primary page. A little box is going to pop up like this. It's going to say your primary page has been changed. And then you will need to click the OK button right here. And that is the only thing that will change your capture page. If you do not click the OK button, it will not change your capture page. So make sure that you do that. And I am not going to change mine at this time. The next portion of this video is to show you where to find your referral link. And this is your um, link that drives your whole entire website. So you're um, going to want to use that. It is the link that goes into the second email in the email series. And you can find that by going up here to social and banners. 
and basically it's makingeasydollars.com and whatever username you use. So this is going to be the link that you give everybody. It sends everybody to the pretty little capture page. They put in their information. They go into your contact list. Um, so this is the drive. This link right here is the driving force behind your whole website. Um, the next thing you're going to need to do before you start promoting is you need to double check and make sure that everything is set up properly in your back office and so that everything goes to the right person. So to check your website, you're gonna to go to a browser that you have never logged into making easy dollars with, or either go to a private window in your browser, and that's the way that you're going to check your website. So I'm gonna go over here to Opera. I'm actually going to go into a private window here, and then I'm going to check mine. So what you would do is you would put in your makingeasydollars.com, um, your banner link, essentially, and then you're going to go here and you're going to put in, just put in a fake email address. It doesn't matter um, what you put in. So let's do, I'm going to do my cat at, cat at um, getstarted.com. Okay. And then click on yes, let me in. This is going to bring you back again to this page right here. And you're going to click your Zazz button right here and double check that everything is working correctly. And to double check that, you're going to log as soon as it pops up. Wow, it took a minute to come up. Um, once you get over to your Zazz site, you're going to scroll down to the bottom and you're going to see where it says you were referred by member whatever. Double check to make sure that this is your referral number for whatever site that you're going to be promoting as your primary site. And then you're all set to go. So um, that is how you um, set up your website. If you need help, um, you can always use the Contact Us button on the MED website. That will send me a personal email. If you have my personal email, you can just send me an email. If you're on my friend's Facebook page, you can send me a Facebook message. Um, if you have done trainings with me, you have my um, my text number, you can text me whatever way you need. Um, I'm here to help you. So just let me know and I will see you guys on the next video that I do. Bye.